Hey crew, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a mini grocery haul of what I'm actually preparing today. Well, what the queen and I are preparing today. And we're gonna start over here. We have some quesadilla cheese, Kobe Jack cheese, Fiesta blend. We have some taco sauce. We have shrimp. We have uh, flour tortillas. We have Doritos. We have the paste. Nacho jalapeno. We have two cans of the Rotel original. We have some mini tacos. And in the back we have five pounds of ground beef. And this will be our little mini grocery haul for today's video. And I'm sure y'all wondering like, what? Is he preparing with this? So if y'all want to know what I'm preparing with this, please stick around and watch the full video. And if you're new over here, please subscribe to the channel and click the bell and set post notifications to all. Like and comment on every video. And if you can, please share out the video. Um, and just thank you for all the oldies but goodies. We really appreciate y'all. So we're about to get into this video. And once again, what is he doing with all these ingredients? Okay, crew, I'm back. So we have five pounds of hamburger meat right here. And we're gonna turn our stove on. And what we're gonna season our hamburger meat with, we're gonna use Tony Sasser's Creole seasoning. Regular salt, liquid smoke, and garlic and herb salt free seasoning. And the only reason y'all don't see like onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, or parsley, or anything like that is because all this is in this one season combined. So I'll show y'all. With the ingredients all of it combined in there so I don't need it so I'm not trying to over season anything or overdo it so we're just gonna go in with our Creole seasoning and let us know how y'all doing Everyone is well. Everyone is doing well. Mama M, you know, she still have, you know, her ups and downs. She have good days. Some days are bad. But, you know, she's still blessed. You know, she can't complain. She's still here. And it's another day in life, you know, that she wake up, you know, to be able to see her family, her grandkids, and her uh, two kids that's here in Mississippi. Then we're gonna put a liquid smoke. And I'm just gonna allow this to cook. Everyone know how to cook hamburger meat. Once it's done and I drain it, I'll bring you guys back so I can show y'all what I'm really doing with all these ingredients. So y'all stay tuned. Okay, crew, we're back. We have the hamburger meat that's ground and drained. And to this, we have two cans of Rotel. I drained this can. And this can, I didn't drain. I'm going to keep the liquid from it. Then we're just going to add our nacho jalapeno paste cheese. I'm gonna cue some music right here so y'all enjoy the music. I 
dark until the first light of dawn Just like fate without no warning It hit me so hard Oh, I'm so sorry, girl, I didn't mean to I didn't mean to I done missed it up again Yeah, I'm sorry if I crossed the line I crossed the line What am I supposed to do? Okay, crew, so we have everything mixed together, and I'm gonna let this come to a boil on this eye over here, and then we're gonna start on sauteing our shrimp. So, y'all, hold on, and I'll be right back. Okay, crew, we're back, and we're gonna saute our shrimp. And right here, we have two tablespoons of butter that's gonna go into the pot, into our pan. We're gonna let this melt. And this is sweet cream salted butter. So what we're gonna do, we have medium peel and duvet shrimp right here that we're gonna add to our pan. And since we wanna season this, we're gonna keep the same flavor profile that we did with our Rotel right there. So we're gonna go with a little bit of Creole seasoning. And don't want too much because like I said, we're using salted butter. We're just gonna keep the same flavor profile. And we're gonna lay this on here heavy and 
And now we're gonna add some liquid smoke. And there we go. We're just gonna let these saute. And you know shrimp don't take long to saute. Let me go back with a little bit more Creole. And a little bit more garlic and herb salt free. And crew, I'm just gonna allow this to cook. And if you see like it's a little liquid in the bottom of the pan, I'm gonna allow this to cook down so some of the liquid can evaporate out of our pan. And once it's ready, I'll bring y'all back. Okay, crew. So the liquid then cooked down. And we just want to put a quick little saute on them so we're gonna leave a little bit of sauce that's in the bottom of the pan and we don't want to overcook the shrimp so we're gonna remove them off the heat and then we'll start preparing the dish so y'all hold on all right crew we back two tablespoons in the pan We're gonna let this melt. I got a treat for y'all on this one. I hope y'all really enjoy this one. And nope, it ain't Taco Tuesday. But hey, we making it do what it do. So we're gonna let this melt all the way. And then we're gonna put our quesadilla together. Y'all don't laugh at me if I burn the quesadilla, you know. Hey, trial and error, you know. Hey, sometimes they come out perfect and sometimes they come out a little burnt. But hey, still gonna eat it. I ain't gonna throw it away. Oh yeah, that's Queen in the background, y'all. She having a uh, fat girl problems, Stuff but no, nah, I'm joking, y'all. No, but you know that's just a saying, fat girl, fat boy problems. You know, people that love food. You know, hey, we love food. Right. It's here for a reason. So here, we got our flour and tortilla. We're gonna put it down. Y'all gonna be like, oh, his pan ain't big enough. Who cares? It's gonna be big enough today. So, we have our saute shrimp. We want a flat. And man, shout out to y'all, man. Y'all. Y'all real. Y'all always support your boy. And special shout outs to our soul sister Ellen. Our sister Tawana. Our sister Cecilia. And um, our sister Tina. So that's our shrimp. And right here we have the Rotel. Y'all be like, man, what is he doing? I ain't never seen nobody do that. He tripping. No, I ain't tripping. If you got the munches, you know what I mean. But no, I ain't got no munches. But you know, hey. All right. So we're going to go in with our Kobe Jack cheese. Y'all heard Queen laugh in the background. 
Yeah, that is true, but we won't be having no much around here. We don't, we don't do that type of stuff. Then we're going to take our queso, quesadilla cheese. And y'all be like, by now, Mrs. Jordan burnt that uh, flour tortilla up. Hey, if I did, and I told y'all I could possibly burn it. So right now, then we got some crunched up Doritos. We gonna just, yeah, put that all in there too. Man, I can't believe I just put all this stuff in a flour tortilla. Did he really just put that in her baby? I guess he did. Hey, it is what it is. Oh, and just for clarification, you can have munchies and, you know, yeah, and not, not participating in extra recreational activities. Yeah. And if you do, then hey. More love. We ain't knocking that. No. It's life. It's a tree of life. Yep. It's herbal. <laughs> you can put it out there in your front yard and it'll grow. But hey, enough about that. We ain't even talking about that. We here for this crazy, insane, off the charts quesadilla. I hope everybody doing well. I hope y'all enjoy y'all week, y'all weekend, and the rest of this month, you know. Because April is slowly knocking on the door. Holy. April. Oh, you said a police. No, ain't no couple knocking on your door over here. Police knocking on door. Hey. If they is, they ain't looking for me. <laughs> so they must be looking for the queen, y'all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that ain't looking for me. I'm gonna pop me though. Yeah, I don't wanna burn my quesadilla on camera. But hey. It is what it is, it's burnt. If it's burnt, this is going to be the queen quesadilla. <laughs> I'm going to eat it too. Okay, so. We're going to give this a little flip right here. If I can get it to act right in the pan. Ooh. Yeah, y'all, we had a little dripping that came out, but other, smell than, so good. other than that. Dripping smell good. Yeah, that sweet cream butter. Ooh. Boy, when Deontay get off of work, that's on the dome. Y'all don't know who Deontay is? That's our oldest son. Last time Jordan made quesadilla, <laughs> me, him, Philip. It was me, John, Philip, Deontay, Alicia. and Alicia. Because we really, we really don't really eat them. Boy, who you would have thought we were by Snoop Dogg house. We were paying that food up. Food we eat. Yeah, I know Snoop. Well, that food was so good. And then John said, yeah, you can take some home. You know, Casey D is big, so we right. figured he's going to take one or two. Man, we woke up the next <laughs> morning. <laughs> It was a half of one now. Like, good lord, D. But hey, that's our son. We love him to Okay, crew. So I'm going to remove this. Okay, so we're back. We're going to do a shrimp quesadilla this time. We're going to drop that right there. Yes, I turned it off a little already. Well, I just turned it off. So I can't see y'all right. Oh. So we got that right there. We're going to go in with our cheese.
And when I make quesadilla, guys, I make sure that I put enough meat in it so it's neat in every bite. You don't want to be too stingy. Just add a little butter. Okay, you want that salty taste? Just drop it right there. We're gonna let this brown. Then I'm gonna take y'all all over to the counter and I'm gonna show y'all both. We're gonna cut them open and show y'all what it looks like. And we're gonna close out this video. Something quick, fast, and simple. And your family will love it. And you also can do it with the kids because the kids will love it. So y'all know after this, I'll be finishing up the quesadillas. I'm just doing two for y'all on camera. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Hey, and if you made it this far of the video, please hashtag cooking with the crew to let us know that it's real. It might go spam with the hashtag. Sometimes it do, but mostly it don't and always come through. And if y'all new over here and y'all watching this, please subscribe to the channel. Click the bell, set post notifications to all, like, and comment on every single video. I promise you, you will not regret subscribing to the crew. And also, we have two other channels. The main channel, Alicia Southern Crew, which will be a family vlog channel. And we have shopping and budget, no. Mississippi. Mississippi shopping on a budget. On a budget. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Hey, she changed the name of the channel, y'all. So, y'all, please forgive me. But that's, once again, Mississippi Shopping on a Budget. And that's the grocery channel. And this is the third channel. Hey, and we may have something in the works with a fourth channel. But we'll let y'all know. So, y'all stay tuned. We out here grinding. Like our boy CZ on 32 say, the only way the game going is up. He got, he got what you say. Grind on stop. For sure. So like we always work. <laughs> <laughs> Nonstop. <laughs> we gonna be on vacation work. Oh yeah. <laughs> but hey, as entrepreneurs and having our own business, a black business owner, you know, you, you can't you can't relax. You got to constantly grind. You got to constantly be in. You got to work like you ain't got nothing. I don't care if you got millions in your bank. You still continue to work like you ain't got that in the bank. You can have whatever car you want. You still work like you ain't got that car. So when you're old enough, you can just sit back and chill and still have income coming in from everything that you done laid out because you done laid the foundation, the foundation and you done built upon that. And hey, you got that residual income, and then you got income from other avenues that you branched off in. So the goal is to have seven streams of income, maybe 10. So I'm going to take this out, crew, and I'm going to take y'all over to the countertop, and I'm going to show y'all what they look like. So hold on. Okay, crew. So here go the shrimp quesadilla. We just took it out the pan. And over here... We have the, did he just put that in a quesadilla? So we're gonna cut this. And we're gonna show y'all what it looks like. And this has the Rotel, the shrimp, the quesadilla cheese, and the Kobe and Jack cheese. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please thumbs up the video. Comment below. And we'll catch y'all in the next video. And we out. Cool it is.